City Life episode. And, uh, today... <laughs> today... Boing. Today we're going to go kill ourselves. We're going to go to the end and jump into the void. And the reason I'm going to do that is because I'm going to go on an adventure today. I'm going to go look for uh, some of the new biomes. I've got a place where I already know that I have horses that I can go to. I've got a portal set up in the nether that I'm going to get to. But in my adventures, I want to be able to have the opportunity to get this achievement. And the only way for that to happen is if this is unlocked. Which I know where the end is but I have to go through the portal to get the achievement. And without killing the dragon, the only way to get home is to kill myself. Unfortunately. It's kind of morbid. But... That's what you gots to do. So my end portal is right over here. Very close to town. That's why, the, that's why I built the place in the location I built it in is proximity to this and just liked the area plus it was it's kind of nostalgia first it was the first NPC villager I found when they made villages a thing all right so end portals right here I've already been been in the end before but my achievements have been reset a few times oh And I died. And I respawn at home. Ready to go on my adventure. So I'm going to need my armor on. Since we're going to the nether, I'm not going to make that mistake again. So I'm wearing my guild helmet of protection. Protection 4, respiration 3, aqua affinity. And the chest plate of protection. Protection 4 again with unbreaking 3. Leggings of protection with protection 4 on them, and cushioned boots of protection with protection 4 and feather falling 4. Should have used some of my experience to put unbreaking on the rest of this stuff before I left, but that's okay. Alright, and I've got stuff that I want to take with me here in the horse fetching supplies. I've got a clock, I've got a bed when I get to the other side of the portal, not for in the nether. I've got Soil's Bane, I've got Stone's Bane 2.0. For a sword I'm bringing Atom Smasher, it's a looting 3, sharpness 5, unbreaking 1, or I mean knockback 1, unbreaking 3 sword. Pretty epic. And instead of Wood's Bane I'm bringing a Blessed Woodsman Axe. Uh, I named it Blessed because it has Smite 5 on it, so it'll deal extra damage to zombies and skeletons. And I've got Arrow Hoarder, my Infinity Power 5 bow. I'm going to bring some Swiftness Potions and Fire Resistance Potions because we'll be running through the Nether for a while. Some Potions of Night Vision for when we get to the Overworld in case it's dark out. I know that since I've scouted the area, I know there's a village nearby. Uh, the plan is to get over to the village, hole up in one of the houses, and uh, if it's nighttime, set a bed and hopefully be able to sleep and change it to day. And then uh, I can maybe find myself a halfway decent horse and go exploring. So, let's get on through the portal. Oh, and I've got some golden apples in case of emergency too. I don't really want to use those if I don't have to. Oh, this is dangerous right here. From that time I was trying to, uh, why don't you go away? From that time I was trying to get the, uh, Achievement for for knocking the gas ball back at him. All right, and I've 
I've really got to do some work here in the nether. This is very, very precarious here, the way that I have to get around. <gasps> Whoa! That just scared the bejesus out of me, man. I thought he was coming for me. I thought he was mad at me for knocking his friend off the ledge. Which, that shouldn't have aggroed them because... It, it didn't aggro them because uh, I didn't attack him. Lava doesn't hurt him, so pushing him into the lava doesn't do anything to him. They just swim around down there. That was a mini heart attack, though. And that uh, tunnel, this tunnel, by the way, first nether tunnel I made, the only nether tunnel I've made, uh, just a cobble hallway with rail on it, and uh, it goes over there to uh, a little hub that's near original spawn, another area that's very outdated and much need in in dire need of work and renovation got a big sheep farm back there and stuff. Alright, let's go down this spiral staircase. Slime block at the bottom of this would be good with a nice just hole to drop down. Or have the portal up top. See, I don't know why these portals are unlit. I was going to grab a flint and steel before I left, but I forgot. So hopefully we don't have any issues with uh, the other portal not being lit. I wonder if there is a bug going on with the nether right now, since it's the new update. I have no clue. I'm going to see if I ha might have a flint and steel here. There's a steel. Or iron, anyway. I've got some gravel here. I could get some flint. I would imagine. Just one piece of flint. Come on, flint. our flint and steel. I'm going to run over and uh, light that portal back up. So when we come back, we might want to use that portal instead of running up there. this now just in case oops not that this put those away eat some fish and now I can do stuff like this and it doesn't matter I don't know if that'll does that hurt my armor doesn't seem to be I mean, obviously I'll still avoid fire, but it's good to not have to worry about it so much. Alright, I'm just going to run through the nether here.
so I might be a little lost. I'm going to check an old screenshot and see if I can find the location of this portal that I'm searching for. So I'll do that and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. And I found a screenshot. The uh, portal I'm looking for is at about 603-166. I'm at negative or negative 603, negative 166, I'm at negative 676, negative 210. So I need to go about 70 blocks that way to the east, and about 40 blocks that way to the south. So I must have just made a quick wrong turn. Yeah, I think I was supposed to go left instead of right up here somewhere. Maybe in that twisty, stupid tunnel system. Oh, it's right there. Ah, we were right here. Awesome. Alright, now I'm going to go through here. And, uh, glad I had this flint and steel with me. I'm going to go through here, and when we get on the other side, it could be it could be day, it could be night. Um, if it's nighttime, I'm going to have that to eat. And if it is either way, not day or night, we're going to make a run for the um, village. Which should be, once we go through this portal away from the jungle. Alright. Here we go. Noivus, Noivus, Noivus. Hello. Are we gonna do it? Okay. Hello. I might have to stop recording for a second and let this load in. All right. I had to relog. Got a little. Things got a little crashy. I guess it was making a new portal since this was our original one, and it is dead, dead, dead ski. So. Yeah, it's a little bit of a 1.8 bug, I think. With portals. Alright, now the village is this way, I think. This doesn't look too familiar, but do you remember we started on the edge of a jungle? Yeah, here we are. We've got a nice big plains biome. We've got some horses. Hello, horses. Some gray ones, white ones. Sheepses. big nice jungle here. I haven't really explored this area too much. I just kind of a long time ago when 1.7 came out I uh, made that trek in the nether and made a portal. Came through it just to get really far away from home to generate some new chunks that could potentially have horses and uh, I got really lucky like the first the first try, I ended up in a biome right next to some horses. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here to this village, which I've already been here before. And I'm just going to kind of set up my bed, set up an ender chest, set up a, a safe place for the night time when it comes. 
torch it up a little bit to make it safe. And uh, I think this will just be my house, this big one. We'll get out our, oops, our bed, our ender chest. So we've got all of our extra supplies in here. I've got some splash potions of healing and speed for the horse if I try to ride the horse home. Some fences for fencing this place in a little bit, which I'm probably going to work on. Saddles leads, some sugar. This helps them uh, grow faster and I think it makes them like you maybe. This is a pickaxe just for uh, silk touch pickaxe just for picking this up if I need to. Um, I'm just going to throw this in the corner because I don't want it. Put this back away. Put these away. And uh, that's been why I organized that. Put this in there. Yeah. Alright. So... I think I'm going to take a quick little break here. And put up a little fence around this place. And uh, just basically, you know, fortify myself just a little bit. Have a halfway safe place to live. I'm not going to start building a giant city here, but I do want to be safe. So, I'm going to work on that briefly, and then I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. I uh, put a nice little simple fence around the place, and torched it up real good. Uh, should be relatively safe. Um, I didn't meticulously go around and make sure there were no spawning spots available and stuff like I do in Bizton Square, but it should be it should be relatively safe. So uh, now I kind of want to uh, start looking at some of these horses, I'm trying to find one that's decently quick. Look at the villagers harvesting their their wheat hard at work but uh I'm gonna put some of this fence stuffs away and I don't really think that I need the uh sugar right or the wheat wheat right now I think that's more for healing them uh I don't want that I'll hang on to that I suppose two saddles. Alright. I'm just trying to get myself organized. Uh, but yeah, that's more for healing them when they're hurt. And I'm just kind of trying to tame them now. And I think you got to start with a empty hand and just kind of do this and rinse and repeat until they let you stay on. Very good. Yep. Now he is my horse. And he has a saddle. And now I can ride him. He's a pretty quick guy, it seems. And they can jump. He doesn't have very many very much life though. Yeah, he seems like a halfway decent horse as far as speed goes and stuff. going to kind of start out by trying the ones that I have here within the town. I'll try this guy. Okay. Come back here. Look how many hearts he has. Quite a bit more health. He's putting up more of a fight than the last guy. There you go get off of him and right click on him to access their inventory. Put your saddle on. He seems about the same speed as the last guy. Careful not to trample the crops. Ooh! Sorry buddy. Can you jump up there? You gotta kinda 
try and jump when it hits that orange. Yeah, he's a pretty good jumper. He can jump three blocks, maybe a little bit more. I think this might be my guy. I might try a couple more, but uh, I think this might be it. I'm not going to be too picky. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to write down my coordinates here. Let's see, we got negative 5,118 and negative 704. We started at negative 144, negative 896. So I went basically just, uh, just, uh, west. I went west about 5,000 blocks. So I'm pretty far from home. Pretty far from home indeed. All right. So I'm just going to kind of pick a direction and head that head that way. So since we came from the east, I don't want to really head towards home. So let's try let's try south first. I should have brought I should have brought my bed so that I can sleep away the night but then again I'm on a horse and I can ride really fast so hopefully this doesn't turn out to be a poor decision horses don't swim so well so I'm gonna try and find a safer crossing around this water but they can walk up these one block gaps so it makes Exploring way easier. All right, here's a really narrow crossing. He should be able to walk across this. Yep. All right, and we're still heading due south. Getting a little bit of lag as the world loads in. And I'm looking for just the new biomes, uh, being specifically the. Uh, I'd like to find a mesa. I would like to find a roofed forest, like right now, so I can have the dark oak wood. Whoa, 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 don't fall over there. I would like to find a, uh, um, a savanna, so I could have the acacia wood. And I would like to find bunnies. So those are like the three main things I'm kind of on the lookout for. Nice little forest biome here. Woo Birch forest up here. That's new. It's one of the new biomes. And uh, these blue flowers in the swamp, they didn't start spawning. Bunnies! Oh my god! So lucky! Hi. No, no, come here. No, 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 don't run away. Don't run away and die. Don't run away and die. Come on. Come on. Stop dying. Oh, the wolves are attacking them. Bad wolves. Bad. Bad, bad wolves. Trying to hurt my little bunnies. Well, that's awesome. I got, I got two. I have two. Where's this wolf coming from? I hear him. I had to. Come on, bunny. I hear a wolf. I don't want him to get these bunnies. There he is. Go away. Wolves, I don't want to kill all of you, but I will. I am preemptively killing any wolves that I see. I had not seen anything about them killing bunnies, but... Makes perfect sense, obviously. Alright, so... I'm going to... Hop back on my horse... And try and get these bunnies 
these little cute little bunnies back to that village I was just at. So let's see. Oh, be careful. Don't get hurt. I wish I had my healing potions with me. Heal these little buggers. Alright. Oh, oh, no, don't get hurt. Stop it. I'm trying to be very careful with you little bunnies. Come, come. Going the right way? Yes, I'm going back north. Oh, wolf. That's right. Fall down the frickin' ravine. Stay away. Come on, bunnies. Come on. Yay! Come on, bunnies. Be careful. I wonder if a tamed wolf would attack a bunny. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Be careful, little baby bunny. No, no, no! Every time they squeak, it scares me. I don't want them to die. They could be the only two bunnies I ever see. They're supposed to be pretty rare. I'm very surprised that I, that I found them right away like this. It's starting to get dark. I think the problem is, is this horse is just so fast that I start to get away from him and it makes him jump these big gaps. Even though I'm trying to go down them very slow. Come on, bunnies. Alright. This isn't the way to go, bunnies. Let's go this way, bunnies. Die. Don't drown. We're almost there, bunnies. We're almost home. Look at We're here. Here we are, bunnies. Come on, bunnies. Is there only one bunny? Come here, bunny. save you. Come, bunny. Come, come. In you go. In, in, in. In, bunny. Bunny, this way. This way, bunny. Come on. We don't have time for this, bunny. Alright. Come down here with your friend. And, yes! You, you come over here. We will tie you right there. Oh, yeah. I got two bunnies so I can breed them and have unlimited bunnies and have potions of leaping and I have a horse. This is the best exploration mission ever. Now I just need to go find those two biomes. So I think I'm going to call it a day. Uh, I'm not going to push my luck. I'm going to go have a nap and uh, resume this later. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to tell your friends. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.